I hope y'all having a good day, and I hope you have something exciting planned for the weekend. Um, I'm not sure what I'm doing this weekend. I think I'm going to lunch and then to walk around a different mall with my dad, which I'm excited about. I mean, I haven't talked to him about it yet, but I'm sure he'll be okay with it. Um, anyway, so I know I haven't made videos for the past couple of Fridays, and I'm sorry, but it's just been way too hot because I have to turn off my fan and open my blinds so that I can film, and um, I just couldn't do that. It was just way too hot in here to even stand for like five minutes, even with the fan on. But it's finally starting to cool down a little. A little. Um, it's getting colder at night. Like, it's really cold at night. But anyway, moving on. Um, but <laughs> what I'm going to talk about today is acting. Yay! And I've been watching a lot of movies with my dad. Um, so I think... I can talk about people's acting now and judge their acting. So, without further ado, the first thing we'll talk about is overacting. And that's when you can tell someone's just really forcing what they're trying to say. Like, I don't have a good example of overacting, but I've seen people that do act, and it's just like, Mm, you're, I, I feel like I don't believe you, like you're not in the part, right? But, I don't know, that's just me. That probably didn't make sense, but. Anyway, the other thing we'll talk about is underacting. And that's when people just, it seems like they're not even trying at all. Like they're just reading off a script and they just can't even, like I said before, get into the part. Like they're just have their lines right there and reading them even though they already memorized them but anyway so the other thing is too much of one thing and that's when like one person in a movie just keeps doing the same thing over and over and over again like a good example of that is um Batman the Batman with um I think 1989 with Jack Nicholson and um I forget who plays her but she just keeps screaming and screaming and screaming like through the whole thing she screams at the littlest things and like it's fine to be screaming when you get thrown off of a building but when <laughs> but when you know Batman's gonna save you and you're falling from like two stories I don't think you really have the right to scream is that just me I don't know. But anyway, so, it's a good movie, but she needs to stop screaming. So, um, the other thing is, really good acting. And that's when you can just believe people, and you can just believe that they are that person, or that they're really playing that role, and it's like you're just watching someone in their day-to-day -day life. And I think that's really cool when you can act like that. And, um... I don't think I ever told you guys this before, and it's kind of been, like, on my mind for a while, but I wasn't really sure about it. I kind of want to be an actor when I'm older, because this is going to sound really stupid, but, like, <laughs> when I'm watching a movie, I always find myself, like, acting like the person in the movie inside my head. Like, if the person in the movie is scared or something, in my head I'll be like... <gasps> I mean, not like that, but, you know, I can't really do a dramatic representation right now. But anyway, <laughs> um, or, like, if they're angry, I'll find myself in my head quoting their lines angrily. Like, I'll be, like, yelling them in my head. I can't believe I'm telling you this. It makes me sound so stupid. But anyway, I don't know. Yeah, so that's what I do. And whenever I see, like, a really cool movie, like, The Dark Knight... Or, um, the past few days, well, the past couple of weeks, I've been watching all of the Pirates of the Caribbean with my dad. And, um, it's so, like when I watch that, or The Dark Knight, or anything that's, like, really cool, or a superhero movie, I always find myself, well, even if it's not a superhero movie, I always find myself after wishing that I could have been in the movie. And, um, so, I figure, I've, I've done this for a while, 
like even with my cartoons and everything when I was littler. But, you know, not to tell you too much of me, because it's kind of boring unless you like know the whole story and I don't have time for that. That doesn't really make sense. But anyway, so yeah, I'm going to try and become an actor. And someday I'm hoping to maybe get to that level where people just believe that I'm that person or believe that I'm that part. And um, I'm hoping to maybe start off with commercials. So look for me in commercials like a year from now probably. I don't know. But anyway, maybe not. I don't know. I'm starting acting. I've been in a music video which is exciting. Um, it's not up on YouTube yet, but it was a Super Kids music video, so I'm excited to see how that went. And um, I'm gonna, I'm in like little things at my church and everything. So, yeah, this video is getting way too long of me just telling you my acting hopes and dreams. <laughs> but anyway, so I say to that way too much. So, oh well. And I got a couple of new jokers. I feel like I should show you. Don't mind me. So this is the first one. He's really cool. He's like got his little cane and everything, like standing all maniacal. And excuse me while I step over here. I got another one. It's like a little rag doll joker. See? And you can like hang him on stuff. But he's really cool. I got my friend Mia a riddler. And um my mom got a Harley Quinn, so I thought that was pretty cool. And for some reason, I still have the box. I don't know why. I guess I just think it's kind of cool, like, with his name and everything. And, like, him on the back and the sides. Yeah. But, um, anyway, maybe next week I'll do, like, a haul video because I got a lot of stuff. And if I get more stuff tomorrow and all that. So, yeah, I might do that next week. So, be sure you subscribe so you can catch that. And all my social media links are down in the doobly-doo. You like that? I like that. Anyway, so thank you for watching. And um, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And tell me down in the comments if you want to be an actor, if you do any of the stuff I do, or if you have any comments on people's acting. And um, if you think I should see any movies, and I will check them out. So that's all for now. And... Goodbye.